Think of the strongest and best chess player in the world right now. Okay, so I'm gonna make a bold statement. The AI of EdTech will be far superior to the greatest tutor we know. And I'm gonna give you a real life, very simple example to explain what I mean. Let's say a student got this question in class. Three plus one. You could answer one, two, three, or four. And let's say this student answered incorrectly and chose two. Now, how will the platform analyze this specific answer? The platform could think that this student has probably thought that the, the addition function is, an, is a subtraction function, and hence choosing three plus one equals two. And then for the student that answered four, they probably got it right. For the student that answered one, they probably have no clue what math is. And for the ones that answered three, they could also think that that student had, had a misconception between addition and multiplication. But let's go back to the student that answered two. How will the platform further analyze this? They would go on further and validate by asking another question to see if that student again makes the same mistake of uh, substituting subtraction with addition. And if actually that mistake happens, the platform will take the student to a lesson that explains the basic difference between addition and subtraction. And then it would take that student on and on and on with learning journeys curated to their own learning abilities and to the mistakes that they're doing and the things that they're getting correctly in order to curate a learning journey for that specific student. Now, think of a classroom of 30 people. How can the teacher keep track of all of these learning journeys and different learning combinations that every single student gets right or gets wrong? And this is only for a very simple question in maths of three plus one. Now, what happens in the world of traditional schooling when a student answers three plus one equals two? This. What does this mean? It means that the days of concentrated elitist product for students for a very small niche are gonna be a thing of the past. The future will have the best learning experiences for students at masses, at scale, and the best quality possible, instead of having it concentrated for a very small group of students, thanks to technology.